Hello everyone, it's me, Silverling Surfer, and right back again after a very long couple year gap. I haven't been recording that often because, you know, school and life and stuff like that. But today we're going to start a new Let's Play, Pokemon Moon. Yes, this game did come out a few years ago, but this time it's going to be something special. It's going to be uh, my own personal playthrough of uh, picking a Pokemon that I decided to pick, as well, and there's reasons behind each one I picked. And so we're going to see how it works for this uh, game. Without further ado, let's begin. As you can see, I can already started it because I had to use Pokemon to transfer, transfer over some Pokemon. But let's get a, t a quick team recap. First up, we got Marini. Uh, I gave each all six of my Pokemon uh, like TMs like that. Because it uh, it'll just bore out the playthrough, you know what I mean? Uh, sorry for that interruption, but um, I gave each of these Pokemon special moves because you know, it'll make the playthrough boring, uh, and I'm trying to make it as enter entertaining as possible. First up, we got Marini with Sludge Bomb, to uh, Stockpile, Surf, uh, Toxic Spikes, and Limber. The reason I gave it Merciless is because I'm trying to let this thing uh, handle uh, when it gets hit by Electric type moves, so it can still battle out. Next, we got uh, the sa this uh, Sand Shrew, which I call Ice Shrew, because, you know, I'm using a little Lin Sand Shrew right now, Ice Steel type guy. The moves Iron Heads, Ice Punch, Earthquake, Aerial Ace, Snow Cluck, which is a use useless ability because I'm not never going to use Hail on this guy. Next up, we got Cutie Fly, with Absorb, Quiver Dance, Bug Buzz, and Dazzling G Gleam, with Shield Dust. Next, we got this Rowlet, especially especially bright this guy with a tackle leafage bright bird sucker punch with long reach as it's hidden ability next we got my little rock and roller with the moves toxic flash cannon rock slide and earthquake when i find like maybe leftovers or some, some sort of like healing hp item i'm probably gonna give it to him his talk it toxic because he has that defense so you can wait out a battle and then final finally but not least we have chimchar Personal favorite of mine. Uh, turn off the volume for my sake. With the moves Leer, Fake Out, Fire Punch, Thunder Punch, with the, with the Iron Fist ability, power up, the, power up those physical type moves. And yeah. They're not all that high level, but ho hopefully after we beat the trainer school and get the XP share, it can be a little bit easier. Now let's go. Uh, Let's go talk to Lily, because she's right here. Here we are. You see, the training school is... it. It's... Uh, uh, one in the world? It's Toru's my man. Gen 1 -er. Well, it looks like we won't be going that way anytime soon, thanks to Toru's there. But we are only planning to go as far as the training school anyway. Well, we'll just leave that for someone else to deal with. If, come, come with me. Again, I got interrupted. Come follow me. Wow, so Lily's not even, she's just, she doesn't care about other people. She's like, well, it's not my problem. Let's go on. So I'm, I'm going to be trying to give these people voices. Hopefully I won't forget them later on in the game. Hey there, Ian. I, I must have passed you you two on somehow, yeah? But welcome to the trash school. A place to learn about how to be a Pokemon trainer. I have ASOS grades and classes, you know what I'm saying? Professor Professor Cook is this is a child you told me about? Yeah. Put him through the red red teach Ridger. Four trainers. You got to be all four trainers at the school in. The experience you surely help. And your Pokemon grow grow stronger. Yeah. Actually Speaking of experience, why don't you take this? Oh yeah. Oh, you get XP share now. I thought it was after for some reason. If you keep that XP share on, oh yeah, oh yeah. All the Pokemon you're on the team can get EXP points from, from battle. The trainers who will take part in this lesson may be outside, inside or outside the school. You may also want to visit our classrooms. Make sure you learn a lot. All right, let the lessons begin. She might not look like all that tough, but that teach trains her kids right. One of her students is even a captain. 
if you want a bit of advice from me, here's something that might help. Once you fly a species of Pokemon once, you can easily see what types of music work best on it in your next battle. Wandering about in tall grass to meet lots of different Pokemon will help th with that. Battle all the time? Oh yeah! Well, we heard it there for first, folks. Let's go kick some butt. And I'm trying to make this uh, channel as PG as possible. If I curse or swear, then I'll just edit it out. On my computer when I get there. Because right now I'm just using my phone. And, uh, yeah. Hopefully I don't have to edit out that many things. <laughs> I've been waiting here for you because the teacher told me to. If you beat my Pokemon, I'll give you a sample, but very important lesson. Well, how to get demolished by an expert Pokemon trainee like me? Youth Athlete Hiromi. Probably said that long. wrong. <laughs> Picky Peck. About to get Picky destroyed. Yeah, comebacks. Level 8. eight. I could probably handle this on my own. Can you, Marimia? Oh no! Ooh. Uh, that did seven, uh, eight, seven, nine points of damage. I should be able to live another one. Ooh. Yeah, surf. And I'm an idiot because I forgot to turn off battling from an animations. <laughs> mm. I mean, it doesn't really matter because we get uh, free healing from uh, Lily, I believe. It's not no big deal. We can just uh. Just go, uh, go to the Pokemon Center. And geez, I did a lot of damage. Flash Cannon, even though you guys can't see it. <laughs> I'm very sorry about that. I, was, I had Chinese guys up a few levels because they will not handle their own. This job, two levels. Yeah, you are not wearing Santa Top. Sand attack. We are not in competitive battling right now. When the time comes when Rock, Rock and Roll evolves to Boulder and then to Gigalith, I'll just ask one of my friends to help me. Yes, everyone's getting levels. Good. Now learn Taunt, Chimtar. You're my homie. 224 bucks. That would not even buy me a potion. Yes, items. I get it. I am an expert competitive battler. Not, not passport. Mm -hmm. Options. Uh, graphics on. Oh man, right, good, good, good. Alright. So how long? Uh, question of the day. Uh, what is your favorite Pokemon? battle with for competitive reasons. Me, for example, I love to be superior because you know that contrary least storm mm, that is pretty spicy there. Pretty strong, uh, fast, hit and power fire, take out the steel types, pretty good. Hi right, kid, just kick your butt. And take your money. Probably get your phone number two. <laughs> Cause that's how they did it in Johto. Oh, dude, so why does that sound so weird? <laughs> but yeah, in the whole, like, gaps, I haven't been recording videos. I've been, uh, you no, know, as I told you, uh, going to school, getting smarter, all that stuff. Bah. Probably gonna make these videos maybe 20, 25 minutes long. Maybe 30 if I feel like it. Tsunami! Bam! Get destroyed, Metapod. Trish string shot at me. Or evolve into a player for you without uh, with happiness. Not learning Ice Ball. You have Ice Punch. You're not learning Sun Spore. Because we aren't catching Pokemans. If I have to, I'll just, put, I'll just throw some balls at its face. Take that, youngster. Joey. Yes, yes, we all know about paralyzation. Some Pokemon benefit from like guts or uh, limber, like Marini. 
But paralyzation could can suck if you're not careful with it. As we talk about getting paralyzed, we have paralyzed heal, which restores one uh, paralyzed heal, which you guys already know that. Vision heals me up. But I like leftovers because they heal me up every turn. Let's go inside. I think it's this lady right here. She gives me a uh, quick claw. Pops sometimes. It makes you go first. We get the rock and roll. Get get a quick uh, toxic. This bad little kid. If you're wondering what happened to the other guy who uh, made po the Pokemon plush uh, plushy videos. Uh, we have been talking that often, so I hardly think he's going to come back. Surf! Drown this Bonds Lee! Uh, what else? Hmm. Yeah, so YouTubing, YouTube is like pretty much taking over the world. Not world, but like, you know, a lot of people are doing it to, to get some money out of it, or to like, you know, have fun or something. I'll be doing this job along with uh, maybe uh, another job when, when I become 16, so I can actually apply for jobs with a, with a school permit thing. But if not, hopefully I get enough subscribers, I can actually start getting money. But make sure you guys always like. Uh, hit the notification bell right down in the corner and subscribe. Being the strongest is pretty cool, but like, it means nothing if you uh, have no friends. Or is, that, or is that just money? You have all the money in the world, but you won't have any friends to have fun with that money. Muck. You gonna pound me and get that uh, poison touch off? Get that poison? Surf. After after this uh, battle, I'm gonna switch Marini with someone. Oof. Oh. No poison. Poison type. I dare you. Surf. Ah, oh, jeez. I miss doing this kind of vi these kind of videos. Oof. I am hurt. If you guys really want me, I'll maybe do some Fortnite videos on a different account. I'll make another account so I can do like uh, other Pokemon content. Or not Pokemon content, because if you do Pokemon content, then you basically have to uh, make that whole channel about Pokemon, I believe so. You're not learning Bite. Wait. Mm, I don't have any dark moves, do I? No. Uh, dark. I just can't think about this right now. Mm. Nah, we think we're fine. If we really do need that buy, I'll just like reteach it at the end of the game. <laughs> That's one of the things that annoyed me about this game. You basically go through an entire game without you uh, getting to move relearning. But then again, she's pretty OP. <laughs> the anime that I want. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, sorry about that. I forgot to mute my phone. I sh don't know if muting my phone actually works for the camera because like, I have to like you know talk. Probably doesn't or does. <laughs> Work up. I don't really see that uh, move used too often in competitive battling. Oh, she had to skip to the least sex back then. <laughs> Attention, all students. Would Ian please come to office on the second floor? Ian to the second office, please. What terrible thing did you do to get to call, uh, get called to the office so soon? Well, you know me, I'm a bad boy. So you did do something. You know I did, girl. Look at this. See how fast I'm going? The cop from the, the popo would never catch me alive. <laughs> have you, have has any of you guys uh, ever been uh, called to detention or uh, 
and call to the office by mistake, or uh, did you actually get detention because you're being a bad person? Either way, uh, I actually never get called to the office because I'm a good kid. Sometimes. Ian, I can't believe that you beat all my students. All my students. Fantastic! After seeing such a performance, I think I'd like to buy you myself. What do you say? Are you ready to take me on? No. Because I. Oh, you must be joking. You do know how much experience you could gain from finding me, right? Yes, I do. Give it a terrifying magnum light. But I need to swap out my mons. I want to lead with, uh. Hey, you, cutie fly. Hey, hey, you, I don't want to be your fan. I don't want to get copyright. Please don't copy strike me. Alright, let's battle the teach. In. Um, uh... Yes, yeah, battle her. Let's get some EXP. As a teacher, I got to see for myself what did you. Jeez, uh, I can't speak today. What you did to be for my students. I mean, I can take on the whole entire school right now. Teacher Emily. Oh, the Magnolites first. What's your second one? Is it the... Is it Youngest at the second? Huh. By the way, uh, I can't stay in with this Magnolite because I would get... Well, I could set up on it, but my fairy and bug moves don't do that much. Just his steel typing. Shimtar, got this. No, the shock. Zap. Shimtar, fire punch in the face. Ugh. Yes, sturdy. How dare you? First and then fire punch. Oh, I was about to make a pun right there. I was about to say, not pun, but like, I was about to say, uh, you know, you like using electric type moves so much. Why don't you take one? But I use fire punch again. Shark <laughs> game to level 11. Key fly. Uh, meow. Uh, where's Key Falcon right there? I'm gonna start giving these na uh, names to all these uh, Pokemon. Because it makes me feel uh, better. Not better, but. I'm not saying the original name sucks. But, you know, they're better names for it, you know what I mean? For Kitty Fly, maybe. Insect Queen? Nah, that's not really a nickname. Well, uh. Flappy. <laughs> what the heck? Flappy? What kind of name is that? <laughs> uh, I'll think of something for these uh, Pokemon. Defeat uh, Trainer Emily. Sensational. You gained $432. Now, I, I could buy a potion with that kind of money. Nice. Maybe you'd like to take over as teacher here for me. Maybe. I could do a better job than you did. All joking aside, though, I do want you to take these for me. It's a little word for, for, for beating me. Five great balls. They, they are great balls. Great balls. Great balls are better at catching Pokemon than normal Pokeballs. Yeah, that's why they call great balls. And that's why we call them Ultra Balls because they're better than great balls, and that's why we call them Master Balls because they're better at catching than every other Pokeball. Except for the Love Ball or no Dream Ball from uh, Pokemon uh, Black and White. Mm-hmm. Now your Pokemon know their moves. They're, those are bit the basics for being a trainer. Oh, day. How about it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Greetings. Captain Illuma here. I can't help but observe, observe your battles. You look so very delightful in battle that I had no choice but to summon you here. <laughs> this is Ian. This, ah, jeez. I keep saying uh, by accident, I accidentally put my, uh, the name that people get, say to me sometimes. This one call me, a uh, Blue Serpent. That's the thing, Serpent, because that's, uh, that's why I put it as my username, so, yeah. This is, uh, Slithering Serpent. I can call myself Serpent, actually. It's sh sh shorter. You moved here to, to a Alola from the Kanto region. He's got real sense for how to use moves, and think he's going to go as far as a trainer. Yeah. Hmm. I see. Then welcome, newcomer. I look forward to seeing the brilliance of your moves in my trial. Indeed. We captains are the ones who conduct the trial. You'll face on your way to challenging the island Kahuna. 
My trial is held in Vernon Cavern. The, tri the trial of Captain Uma. You can find Pokemon living everywhere, even the patches of tall grass in Hallelui City. Prepare perhaps you want to fill out your team a bit before attempting my trial? I sincerely look forward to your challenge. I mean, I got a full team six, so I don't really like having Pokemon this early six a whole team six this early because it seems like a little OP, but eh, what can you do? Oh yeah. <laughs> I reported to the folks upstairs about the uh, Taurus blocking the road out front again. <laughs> the guy's Tauros is pretty much a celebrity here, I'm Millie Millie, you know? Well, well, I guess it's time that we dismiss you from school, Ian. Er, I knew it was her speaking, I, and I even said that. Attention, all students. Ian has completed his session at Trans School. Be good to your Pokemon. Mm -hmm. Be good to your Pokemon and try to follow through with those status conditions, too. Good luck, good luck for your island challenge. I hear we get close to a, to a lot of new. <laughs> I hope we can get close to a lot of new people. Ian, enjoy your island challenge and be sure to use the skills you've learned to get to training school. Good luck, future champion. Make sure you use that TM. Make your Pokemon moves the strongest. <laughs> Show them what you made of, Serpent. You seem to be in perfect sync with your uh, Flapper, weren't you? <laughs> flapper, that's a new name. Um, well, since we come this far together, why don't I show you some more city? Come on, that's lots to see. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done with training school. They didn't talk, teach me anything new. Come on, Lily. Come on. Why are you holding me up? Serpent, over here. Yeah, I can see myself, Lily. You know, I was really impressed seeing how you handled battle with your Pokemon at training school. And even back when you weren't yet a Pokemon trainer, Se Serpent, you were able to save Nebby. You were chosen by your Pokemon so quickly. I understand why now. <gasps> oh, I've got a Taros! Oh my, oh my. What? Ho ho ho! If it isn't Lillian Serpent. Sorry for scaring you, friend. I guess it's time I get old Taurus back home. But oh, Hala is gonna make you Hala. But why don't you give him a little pat first, Serpent? Uh, I don't. I didn't crazy things. Ooh. Ah, you see that? This rascal already loves you. Pokemon become happier when we show them some care. Really, I never knew that. So I, I always thought like you know if they die, you just revive them, you know. Ha ha ha! Oh, the place you go, child. And as you do, you surely meet more Pokemon than people you that will enrich your life. You see that? The Kahuna sure are something, eh? Be able to claim a ring in Pokemon without even needing battle. Now that's something. I mean, like, I like the Tauros plenty and all. But it's scary. I don't want to ride on it. Yeah. So where are you two off now? I was, th I was thinking of showing Ian around Holly City, City a bit. Nice idea. You're always on top of things, Lele. Serpent, you just got here to Alola, huh? Then let me tag along, do. I want to get something good to eat. Alright, let's all go together. Yeah, then what we're waiting for this way. Come on, come on, let's go, let's go get some malasadas. malasadas. Over here, yeah. Oh, wow. I guess we should go catch up him before he gets too far, Serpent. Hello City is the biggest city in all of Alola. Holy City Beachfront. Here, a beautiful night sky. I 
remember seeing this in the trailer. It was like so wild to me and my friends. They're like, whoa, man, look at that. I was like, what? The slowpoke? <laughs> it's funny. Beach time, y'all! Uh, uh, hmm? Hey, you. Come on. You came to Alola from someplace far off, haven't you? I can tell. Oh, can you smell, you? smell me? Then let me teach you the proper way to greet someone in Alola. Alola. Give it a try, too. Just like that. Alola. You'll make more friends if you say that. Well, talking about friends all. Uh, I'm going to end the video off here because it's about 25 minutes. Uh, hopefully you guys uh, you guys come back and see uh, in the next video tomorrow. Make sure you guys hit, smash that like button, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for daily content. Alright, see you guys off in the next episode. Bye.